Well, a few years ago, Shield 616 was in Bemidji to give local law enforcement some new safety equipment. Now the organization is back to help out Hubbard County. Reporter Sherelle Moore takes us into their vesting ceremony. A lot of times it's hard to put that in a budget, stuff that doesn't get used very often. And so that's where you, the community, have stepped up and have been a blessing to your local law enforcement and have been able to provide something potentially life-saving. People of Hubbard County are thankful for the service of their local law enforcement. And they found a way to show their appreciation in more than just words. Uh, when I walked in the room, I saw all the vests lined up like that, and it was very touching to see the amount of support, you know, with all the people that came. The goal of SHIELD 616 is to protect officers against rifle threats, while also building healthy relationships with the community. The vesting ceremony is a chance to do both. We were able to donate 30 vests. We've been able to equip all of Hubbard County, all of Park Rapids Police Department, and, and Akeley Police Department. And what's so awesome behind me is the, the community that have that made these funds available, they're getting to interact with them, they're getting to check out the gear that they donated. Along with the vest, each officer also gets a ballistic helmet, safety glasses, and a gunshot wound trauma kit. All the gifts are made possible through donations. It just, it's word of mouth, it's social media that these communities see and that's how we spread. Two years ago, Shield 616 came right here to Bemidji to give a vesting ceremony to the Beltrami County Sheriff's Department. The Park Rapids community learned about that service from that ceremony two years ago and that's part of the reason why Shield was here today. We did uh, actually multiple up there in the Bemidji region and somebody here was part of it and saw it and said, hey, I want to get that going here for Hubbard County and for Park Rapids and, and now here we are today and they're all taken care of. The equipment is not for everyday use. It's only meant to be worn during the possibility of a threat. For the officers, knowing they have an extra level of protection puts them at ease. We know it's high quality protective gear and it's, it's something that we can use and um, I know that it's going to offer the best protection available for our guys that are out there doing the job. Just like Shield 616 was saying, they hope we never have to use it, and I feel the same way, but if we do, it'll be there. Reporting in Park Rapids, Shrum Moore, Lakeland News. And you can get information about Shield 616 on their website. We have the link on our, we have the link, I should say, on lptv.org with this story. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.